Hey guys, Jacob here. Uh, it is Sunday. Happy weekend. It was about a week ago that I asked you guys for comments and questions and I said that I would answer them. So, back, having more coffee. This time it's coffee and answers. Shout out to Homeboy uh, Industries. Uh, Alright, Dragon Breath Opal 13 asks, uh, Hey Jacob, Chloe here. Just found you today. Ended up here after your appearance on Nerdist News, um, which was fun. Thank you, Nerdist News. Uh, Chloe asks, if you could travel anywhere, where would you want to go? That's a tough question. I honestly don't know. Somewhere I could go surfing uh, on a fun surf trip. That'd be cool. Uh, Michael Warbucks says, I have a show too called Hashtag Coffee with Bucks where I do the same Q&A format. Can we collab in the future? Stay awesome, Jacob. Yes, we can. Uh, TH313LUD says, Can I have your co-host and curator on YouTube Nation's Harley cell phone number? LMFAO. No, but seriously. LOL. Um, no, you cannot. Uh, Julio Casper says, how do you feel about 50 cents? The money or the rapper? Money, great, rapper, grade two. Uh, Scotty Malagro asks, what's up, Scotty? He says, uh, how do you get into hosting? Were you ever into scripted fictional content? Or did you always know you were interested in more news-like media? Always loved the news. When I was in high school, I was in plays. Um, but I got into hosting by coincidence, working in politics. I did my Why Tuesday project on YouTube, actually, how I got my start. You guys should check that out. Here it is. Ding, ding, right there. Um, that was an annotation. If you're not watching, the, uh, maybe there's a place where you can't click on that and I just look crazy. Um, Jordan Thorpe asks, what are your top five favorite YouTube videos? I'll give you my number one favorite. James Kotecki, political video blogger in the 2008 election, had Ron Paul show up to his dorm room. So crazy. You should watch that. Um... Here it is. Ding. Uh, about Nat Life says, how can I work for YouTube Nation? I really admire you guys. Would love to be a part of the team. I'm a graphic designer from Jamaica. Email info at YouTubeNation.com. Info at YouTubeNation.com. Um, Hella DJ asks, oops. Hella DJ asks, how many pots do you smoke? <laughs> I don't smoke pots. Um, Chance1201 says, good or crumble? Hmm. I don't know how to answer that. Jimmy Down asks, do you see the ever-growing presence of networks as an ultimately healthy thing for YouTube? Yeah, of course. Um, one of my favorite networks to watch is Vice News. Or Vice, Vice News. I've been watching this morning, actually, or last night, the live streaming of the Ferguson protests in Missouri. It's incredible. Don't even have to turn on television. Um, skunk wagons, boxers or briefs, a winky emoticon. Um, boxer briefs. Uh, Ian David, will you ever give a tour of YouTube Nation? I already have. Here it is. Ding. Uh, Jay Harat says, your look changed when you started YouTube Nation. Did you have a stylist to help you with that, or was it a natural progression? It's pretty cool, by the way. Also, have you been to Australia? Do you plan to? Uh, my shirts from YouTube Nation come from my wife's company, Band of Outsiders. And, uh... Uh, yes, I have been to Australia, and I'm hoping to go back in October. We'll see if that works out. Um, Rambling Roo asks, what's your favorite thing about YouTube? Talking with you, Rambling Roo. Um, say, was, I mean, what? Says, did you have anyone to inspire you to make start making videos and work at YouTube Nation? Huel Hauser, legendary Southern California TV broadcaster, was, uh, I ran into him when I was making my first YouTube video ever, and, uh, it's, it was like what fueled me to continue going, doing what I'm doing. Um, and you should watch that. Here it is. Ding. Uh, Sarah Davis says, asks, are you single? LOL. No, I'm not. Got a ring on it. Um, Nishant Kadamuan asks, what's been the funniest thing that's happened at YouTube Nation? I don't know. God, we have funny things happen every day, but I did the ice bucket challenge which is freezing and pretty funny. It's going to be on the show tomorrow on Monday. Um, Asger Thetan asks, where did you study? How did you get into YouTube Nation? I studied at um, New York University, and I got into YouTube Nation, or like I met the folks doing YouTube Nation because I had known them from years ago. Um, Zadi Diaz and Steve Wolf did Jet Set Show, then Epic Foo, and I had a meeting with them like everybody else did, and uh, it all worked out. Um, they're the best, and YouTube Nation is the best. Um... Brian Nielsen, how many pairs of glasses do you own and where do you buy them from? These are from Garrett Light Optical. And 
I have like two pairs of glasses with my current correction in them, but I think I lost the other one. So just one. And these ones are really scratched. I don't know if you can see. Um, Niqual asks, how old are you? How'd you get the job at YouTube? I'm 31. Uh, how'd you get the job at YouTube? Already answered that. I'm um, always wondering how people at companies like YouTube, Google interview people. Is it scary and nerve wracking or is it actually a breeze? I'm nervous about everything. Um, Jace asks, has Miles ever given you his award before? No, Miles has, come to think of it, Miles hasn't. So Miles, please. Miles is also my brother's name. Um, but I haven't gotten the Miles award yet. Um, James Watterson, how do you get to work for YouTube Nation? Already answered that. Uh, Master of Cool says, I have, first of all, I'm a middle schooler that lives about an hour from LA. I hope to be an actor or a curator. I'm curious what I should do to launch my career. Put videos on YouTube. That's what I did. And it works. All right, I think that's it. Did I miss anybody? Guys, thank you. Any more comments and questions? Let me know below. I'll do this again next weekend. This is fun. Okay, everybody. See you on YouTube Nation tomorrow and take part live tomorrow night. Bye-bye. Oops.